This is a, a mosque in Gaza City, which people who live in this area say was hit at least twice during the night. A lot of mosques have been targeted in Gaza since this Israeli aerial campaign began. The Israelis say there were 60 airstrikes overnight, and there have certainly been more this morning. We've seen mosques targeted. We've seen security buildings. Earlier on, we were just down by the Gaza port, where fishermen's huts had been hit as well. And the overwhelming mood in Gaza is becoming one of defiance, even among people who don't support Hamas. And Hamas's political popularity was probably falling before this Israeli bombardment began. But faced with this kind of thing, people tend to come together. Barbaric. It's just unbelievable what they're doing. They lost their mind. They don't have any targets to target but worship place. And whatever claim they have is baseless. Uh, uh, they're just losing the war. Anybody who's acting by targeting, worshiping places, that means he lost the war. And, and we either live in dignity and free, or we all die. I mean, the children, they see the children, they're coming. They're not accepting what's happening. The Israelis are mad, and they're doing it with impunity in front of the whole free world, and the free world is watching. And they're approving their action by not reacting to what they're doing. They're approving it. So the world is failing Gaza? It's failing Gaza. The world is failing, and the leader of the world, even the U.S., England, France, Russia, all the Arab world, they're just puppets. They're just following their, their pocket and the money. But here in Gaza, as small as it is, will define the world and will tell the world that we either live free or we die here. But however disproportionate this is, what do you think of the argument that if Hamas stopped firing rockets into Israel? No, no, th this is not an argument. We've, we've been in blockade for the last seven years. We've been, we've been deprived of all this for the last seven years. Don't talk to me about rockets that is so tiny, small. Well, look at this. Look at this. Uh, this is nonsense argument. It's nonsense. We didn't start it. They started it. And they've been in, in the 2000 eight agreement they have fulfilled nothing 2012 they have fulfilled nothing so why should we believe that this time ceasefire they say okay let's negotiate negotiation with the israeli yeah. is waste of time